Good morning. So, hi, I'm <laughs> saying good morning. Hi, Hello, everybody. Hi, Yo, you having some bread? It's toast, actually, silly Billy. Mm. Silly, no, silly no, looking. Bread. Oh, it's bread. It's bread that turns into toast, isn't it? No bread. Just bread. So, once again, Alex didn't wake up this morning, so we had to um, take him into work. So, we've just got back. Um, we're having some breakfast, and then we are going to go and see my mum. So, we've got to do a little errand today where we have to sort of go into Thompson's. Or Thomas Cook. Thomas Cook, I think, we flew with. And it's basically because... Um, Alex's full name is Alexander and when we went to book the tickets we just sort of give them our names at the start just so that they could fill in like so they could find a holiday you know how they always ask you for your name anyways but we just give them like Alex's no name is Alex and when we come to like sort of give our passport and we were like mind his name's Alexander and they were like all right yeah no brother I'll we'll see if we can change it and it didn't change when we looked at the tickets so then we went back in and it was like mind you it still says Alex is it gonna be okay and they were like um no it's not gonna be okay you're gonna have to pay 50 quid or you'll have to pay 75 pound when you get to the door like get the gates to sort of go on holiday and I was like well we asked it to be changed blah 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 and um long story short we paid the 50 quid they were meant to change it. We went to go on holiday and the name hadn't been changed. So he went on holiday with the name Alex and it didn't matter according to them. So I wasn't a happy bunny. So we're gonna go in and see if we can get that refund because 50 pound is a lot of money when you've just spent a lot of money on a holiday. So I will let you guys know if that happens. Where are we gonna go? We're gonna go and see Nan. So where are we going? Woo, woo. No, we're just leaving for um, me mum's now and I'm on my way to pick Alex up from work. As usual, I'm running late. I think we are probably the late family. That's just how we roll. And I think it's probably a big thing to do with having children because children just really like complicate things. Like they make it really related. It's not just as simple as putting your shoes on and leaving the room like leaving the house so all we've done today really is just go around the shops and the Thompson thing which I was telling you about this morning and um, basically they've put like a, um, a complaint in or something within Thompson's and I've got to wait 20 days to see whether I can get it back you need a wee wee right well, you're gonna have to wait okay can you wait are you ringing daddy you can tell daddy, do you need a wee wee now? Right, okay, we'll not be long, okay? So, like I say, having kids are complicating. <laughs> not just putting your shoes on. Just finished work. It is 20 to seven and I've just got home. So what happens when you sleep in? <laughs> Eventually I've decided to actually work today. <laughs> Rather than working instead of eight hours I'm meant to be there, five and a half. Which is what I worked yesterday. Six the day before. Oops. So now I'm really down on my flexi balance, which means I now have to stay late every day. Yay. I don't even know what to say now. <laughs> like that whole conversation has <laughs> just left my head. We've just had a full blown conversation with you. And it, and it didn't. didn't record. <laughs> the camera just switched itself off and we just looked at each other as if to say, what did I you hope talk? that recorded. <laughs> and it didn't. <laughs> So basically it was about ticks on dogs what is the remedy of getting rid them of them off or keeping them off or i don't know without having to spend 50 pound on frontline any suggestions good night say night good night say night night molly to see what it was Say night night, Molly.